The Raspberry Pi Camera Module V2 is the newest version of the camera module for the Raspberry Pi. It connects using the CSI port on all of the Raspberry Pi boards, and the nice thing about the new camera module is that it actually has an 8 megapixel Sony sensor, as opposed to the 5 megapixel Omnivision sensor on the old version. The new camera sensor is capable of doing 1080p video at 30 frames a second and taking large high resolution photos, so it's great for any Raspberry Pi project where you might be doing computer vision or just taking a nice photo. To demonstrate the capabilities of the new camera module, I decided to build this tweeting camera. Now this camera body is actually something that I picked up from a thrift store, and it is a vintage camera body. In the front you can see I've mounted the Raspberry Pi image sensor facing out, and I've taken the lens off the front since the camera has its own lens. On the inside you can see that I have a Raspberry Pi 3 in a Raspberry Pi case to keep it from shorting out against the sides of the metal enclosure, as well as one of our power cell boards and a lithium polymer battery for power. I've replaced a few of the mechanical controls that were on the original camera with new electrical controls. For instance, the shutter is now a micro switch on the front, and on the bottom here, this was the film release, this is now the on and off switch for the whole device. To use it, I just move that into the on position, and on the back we should see that this LED lights up as soon as the Python script that handles this whole operation is running. Now to take a picture, all I do is look through the viewfinder and then click on the shutter lever right here, and then the Python script that's running on the Raspberry Pi will capture an image from the Pi camera module, and then it'll upload it straight to a Twitter account that I made specifically for this camera. If you want to build your own, I've put all of the code and wiring diagrams on GitHub so that you can follow along. The link to that will be in the description for this video. And if you do build your own, tweet us a pic of it because I'd love to see what kind of enclosures you can find to build your own camera.